Now, those of you still trying to dig out from all the snow, you can blame El Nino for that. These back-to-back -back winter storms are a hallmark of El Nino. But the Arctic blast, which brought record cold temperatures to parts of the country, is something else. There's no question the cold has been brutal, especially for those producers checking on livestock. Now, Drew Lerner of World Weather says the Arctic air is caused by a warming that occurs in the stratosphere, which is outside of where we live here in the troposphere. The stratosphere, when it turns warmer, it expands that layer in the atmosphere and it pushes, puts pressure on the troposphere and forces cold air that's aloft down to the surface. And then it gets spread out from the Arctic. And in what happens a lot of times when you get these stratospheric warming events is that you displace the polar vortex and or you split it into two vortices. And that's what's happening.